So Dave gave you the okay, huh? Well, welcome then. I run the Museum of Dave, where the children of the Republic can learn about their heritage. Sure, the Museum of Dave is happy to answer any questions on behalf of the Republic of Dave's Office of Tourism. President Dave is the savior of the wasteland, bringing peace and order to the savages man has brought upon himself. If you would like to learn more, please stop by the Museum of Dave's official tour at 2 p.m. How very Dave-like. Come back and visit the museum anytime. So, I'll just get started on the tour of the museum then. To my far right is the baby carriage that our great leader slept in as a newborn baby. Unlike most babies, he never cried and his poop didn't stink. Dave had eight siblings and made his own baseball team. The team was so good, in fact, the Wasteland team was so scared, it never showed up to compete. The briefcase is the very one Dave took with him when he became fed up with the poor ways that his father ran the nation. Dave brought back many items from the You're wasteland. Kind of weird. It was artifacts like these that amassed the Republic's great wealth. Dave collects many war collectibles, including holotapes and war weaponry. This globe represents the whole planet that Dave traversed. Don't let its size fool you. The world is at least 50 times bigger than this. I don't know who put that tire there. These weapons were used against the USA before the bombs fell. Dave probably acquired these when he walked to China. Dave is a world-renowned marksman, known for shooting an apple out of the hand of a raider from across the Potomac. Mounted to my left is the very head of the slain Deathclaw that Dave encountered during his quest through the wastes. I know what you're thinking, and no, that's not a Brahmin skull. Brahmin have two heads, so there'd have to be two skulls for it to be Brahmin. Please, no touching. And that's the tour. I hope you enjoyed it. Be careful! Oh! Oh!